So Clinton's first interview back on the trail featured pressing questions about what TV shows she watched when she was off the trail. She she really does not appear to be taking this election seriously. She needs to talk policy. This is a stupid strategy. When your opponent is Donald Trump and you seem like the bigger clown, this avoidance, she's coming off as a clown. I know that she's trying to, like, avoid talking about policy because she doesn't want people to know what she thinks or something. But it's just making her come off like an amateur. She seems like the bigger idiot. When your opponent is Donald Trump and you seem like the bigger clown. It's pathetic. Okay, hate the guy, but he's out there laying down a platform. She's not. She's avoiding reporters and calling people names. This is starting to look a lot like 2000, okay? More and more like 2000. She's as bad as Gore. Is she trying to lose? Is that it? Did she win the nomination only to hand the presidency to the Republicans, who she usually agrees with more? So she doesn't have to listen to Sanders and Warren getting on her ass? You can just go out there and agree with Paul Ryan? Is that what this is about? Forget about Trump working for Clinton, okay? Right now, it looks more like Clinton is working for Trump. Clowns to the left of me, and jokers to the right. I'm not even, I'm not, I'm not in the middle, I'm way out to the left, okay? But Clinton's remarks, okay, th th this is a quote from Breitbart. When I'm agreeing with Breitbart, you know the situation is dire, okay? This is a dire circumstance when I'm agreeing with Breitbart. But Clinton's remarks drew comparisons to rhetoric from former failed Republican presidential nominee Mitt Romney, who pointed to the 40%, 47% of America, sorry, not 40%, but 47% of America, that were just looking for a handout from the government. They're right. That's what this comes off as. Totally out-of-touch elitist. What a buffoon. She says nothing about anything of any consequence, and when she opens her mouth, she says this. It doesn't matter if it's true, okay? If, I, if somebody's fat and I call them... Okay, you want to know what's true? What's true is that Hillary Clinton looks like a fat old cat lady. That's true. She does. Nobody should tell her that. Or what's the use of telling her that? Uh, it makes no, it makes no difference, right? She's trying to win an election here. Does it mean she wants at least a couple of those people to vote for her? You, you're deplorable. Actually, let's, let's, let's do it. Let's be honest here. You, you're deplorable. Yeah, that's... that's that, I'm trying to sound like Donald Trump here. You, you're deplorable. Get her out of here. She's deplorable. Let's be honest. That's what it sounds like. I mean, can I count on your vote? You deplorable. You fucking dipshit. Now, listen. Okay? It doesn't matter where you stand on the spectrum. It doesn't matter who you support. This is an objectively stupid thing to stand up and say in front of the press. You want to be honest? You're a fucking dipshit.